Hey defenders, welcome back to our channel. So today, let's talk about something really interesting. It's about Swayat Robots. Swayat Robot CEO Sanjeev Sharma is the founder CEO of this company and recently made headlines when the billionaire Anand Mahindra shared a video of a self-driving Bolero SUV modified by Sharma's team. The interesting part is it navigates throughout the streets of Bhopal. Uh, in the recent interview, with uh, Sharma, he boldly claimed that they are already a competitor for the huge EV giant Tesla. Can you believe that? Yeah. And Sharma also added saying, what are we demonstrating is a tech ready to navigate the traffic of India with utmost accuracy. Right? The interesting part is we are already a competitor for Tesla, Sharma added. Give us some more funding and some more resources and we can literally solve the automation problem by the end of this year, Sharma said. How cool is that, right? And uh, uh, it is so interesting to see indigenous uh, thoughts and inventions coming like this, uh, especially having said there are huge companies like Tesla and Winfast across the world who are uh, making strides in this uh, EV space along with the autonomous car space. This is an indigenous product. Let me tell you, even if Tesla comes to India tomorrow, I personally think there would be a lot of problems because of the way India and Indian traffic operates. It is chaotic most of the time, right? But if there is an Indian who can actually come around with the technique to solve this problem, I think he would be the best person instead of a, a foreigner doing it. It would be great if an Indian can find a way out. And I think that may be a lot better uh, solution that we can connect to better than the other one, right? This is also similar to the video that I posted last month where you actually saw this engineer uh, Mankaran Singh, right? Who actually completely drove an autonomous Alto car with the Redmi Pro, the used uh, mobile phone with the open source software called the Open Pilot and Dialogflow, right? How cool is that? I'm extremely happy and excited by the whole idea that this kind of a large technology, complicated, complex technology is starting to come to the hands of anyone who has access to the internet and access to reading and understanding the information, right? And I think this year is probably the year that starts the, uh, you know, upcoming years of a lot of innovations in the tech space, especially on the transportation space, right? In case you like this content or if you think someone would love to hear something of this sort, please consider sharing and subscribing. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech insights on cybersecurity.